Hey kids, welcome back to Little Lab, the channel that makes science fun and easy for you. Today, we're going to explore the amazing science of the moon. The moon is Earth's closest neighbor in space. It is a rocky ball that floats around our planet. It's about one quarter the size of Earth, which means it would take four moons to add up to the same size as Earth. It's also the brightest object in the night sky. Did you know that people have actually been to the moon and walked on it? Astronauts traveled to the moon many years ago when your grandmas and grandpas were kids. Astronauts are people who study and explore space. They wear these cool spacesuits and float around in outer space. They fly in spaceships and do all types of cool science stuff in space. The moon is located about 238,855 miles away from the Earth. That's really, really, really far. It takes about three days for spacecraft to travel to the moon from Earth. You'd have to drive a car for about six months straight to go that far. The moon floats around the Earth and travels around the Earth once every 27 days. As it moves, we see different parts of the moon's surface from Earth. Sometimes we see the full moon, and other times we see only a sliver or a crescent shape. But what is the moon made of? Scientists believe that the moon is made of rock, dust, and ice. It has a rocky surface with craters, mountains, and valleys. Despite being close to the Earth, the moon is not a place where people can live. The moon has no air to breathe and the temperature on the moon can range from extremely hot to extremely cold. And there's no water or food. This is why astronauts who visit the moon have to wear special suits that give them air to breath and protection from heat and cold. The moon's gravity is about one-sixth of the gravity on Earth. This means that objects weigh much less on the moon than they do on Earth. This is why astronauts on the moon float around a little. The moon is covered in craters, which are dense and marks from meteoroids that crashed into the moon a very long time ago. Meteoroids are big rocks that fly around space and bump into things. Okay, that's enough science for now. Isn't the moon so cool? We hope you enjoyed learning about the science of the moon, and we'll see you next time on Little Lab. Make sure to subscribe and watch more videos. Bye.